I'm gonna pull these lyrics up just in case. I probably don't need them, but. Security. Mm -hmm. Yeah, security blankets are nice. You are right. Y'all having a good time? Yeah. I can't believe it's already 9.15. Okay, I think I can do it. It's a Guy Clark song. I grew up listening to Jerry Jeff, so I knew what his yeah. Jerry Jeff Walker song first before I became a songwriter and then realized that sometimes songwriters weren't the ones that made songs famous. And it, it, you know, you grew up listening to, um, was it Bob Kingsley and Country Countdown every Sunday morning on the way to church. And most of those songwriters, other than Alan Jackson, they weren't writing those songs. And so it was just really, um, as I grew older and started doing this for a living and looking up lyrics to learn how to play songs, I, I taught myself how to I play by ear, I always have. I don't gave myself guitar lessons, I don't know what I'm doing, which is why I'm very limited. But um, I I would find out that the writers weren't the people that sang the songs. I was like, oh, well, who's that? Then you go look that person up and go, oh my gosh, they wrote all of these songs, like Sonny Throckmorton and Bob McDill. Bob McDill, one of my favorite country songwriters in the world. He wrote Amanda, and he wrote um, Good Old Boys Like Me, which is my favorite Don Williams song. But Guy Clark was one of those that had written so many songs that I grew up listening to from Ricky Skaggs and anyway, Jerry Jeff cut a lot of Guy Clark songs. So I'm going to try to do this by request for this little water whiskey that I just got handed. <laughs> Did, is this Buffalo Trace? My acres. All right. I'm going to, somebody's going to be making me mark my way back to the hotel on foot. <laughs> we'll, we'll sure you get home. Oh, yeah. She always bored me <laughs> Throw out those L.A. papers A moldy box of vanilla wafers Adios to all this concrete Gonna give me some dirt road back street Don't you think it's time? 